Hi guys, this is Wendy from Wendy's Tarot. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to do an all signs love reading. We're going to be asking the cards, what are their current feelings for you? What are their current feelings for you? So whoever it is that you are connecting to in love right now, whoever it is that you're dealing with in love, just think about that person right now. And we're going to be seeing what are their current feelings for you. Now, if you end up um, enjoying this video or if you end up feeling like it connects with you or it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it if you haven't subscribed already, of course. All right, let's get started with Aries. Aries, what are your person's current feelings for you, Aries? Okay, we have the Justice card here. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Page of Pentacles in reverse. And the Queen of Wands in reverse. So for some of you, um, you're dealing with someone who's already married or who's already in a commitment or in a relationship someone who is involved with somebody else and they're not taking action towards you for that reason because they don't want to be unfair with the justice card upright they don't want to be unfair they don't want to um you know treat you in any way that you don't deserve so i feel like this person is holding back from taking any action from towards you or holding back from uh, making any offers offers towards you yeah because um they feel like it's not the right thing to do right now it's not the right time um or you know it's it's not fair to you let me clarify here the justice card yeah we have knight of wands in reverse yeah, so they don't really want to use you or take advantage of you, okay? They want to do what's fair for you. All right, Aries, I hope that resonated. Let's move on to Taurus. All right, Taurus, what are your person's current feelings for you, Taurus? And we have the Four of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, the Magician upright, and the Five of Pentacles upright. Taurus, I feel like this person wants a reconciliation with you. Um, they want to try to manifest you back into their life. Um, they might have lost you here at some point. They separated from you at some point with the Five of Pentacles. Um, but we have the Four of Wands, which means that they do want a relationship. Maybe they already had something stable with you and they want to recover that stability that they used to have. If not, then they want to create stability with you. Let's clarify the Magician, please. King of Swords, clarify Four of Wands, Eight of Wands, Three of Wands. Yeah, they want to communicate with you. They want to reach out to you. There was something unfair here with the Justice card in reverse. And I feel like this person feels guilty and they want to apologize. All right, Taurus? Okay, that's what I see for you. Give me a thumbs up if that resonated and let's move on to Gemini. Gemini, what are your person's current feelings for you, Gemini? Okay. 
We have Six of Cups in reverse. The Star card in reverse. Five of Pentacles upright. And the Five of Cups in reverse. So this person feels um, like it's over between you two and they're sad about it. They feel depressed about it. Um, I feel like this person misses you. I feel like they keep thinking about you. They keep thinking about memories that you two share together. They feel like you abandoned them or you left them out in the cold here with the Five of Pentacles. Um, all right, let me clarify here. Clarify Six of Cups, please. Wheel of Fortune. The Death card. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Ten of Wands in reverse. Yeah, they feel like they feel like you're over them and like you're never going to return back to them. Yeah, but they still feel like there's unfinished business between you two. They still feel like they feel incomplete. They feel like I think this person like needs closure. Yeah. I don't I don't feel like this person wants to force you into coming back to them. Um, it's almost like they need closure. They feel really um, sad and depressed since since you left, but um, they real they recognize that you're not going to return back to them. All right, that's what I see, Gemini. Give me a thumbs up if it resonated, and let's move on to Cancer. Cancer, what are your person's current feelings for you, Cancer? And we have Eight of Cups in reverse, the Chariot upright, the Queen of Swords upright, and the Queen of Wands upright. So this person wants to return back to you here with the Eight of Cups in reverse. They want to um, move towards you, they want to take action towards you, or they want to travel here to see you. For some of you, there's distance between you two. Um, I feel like this person has was waiting for you to to be the first to be the first ones to contact them or to communicate with them or reach out to them. Um, I think they realize that you're not going to do that because you're appearing here as the Queen of Swords and the Queen of Wands. So um, you're very firm in 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 who you are and in what in in what you deserve. Yeah, so you're 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 not easily manipulated here. Um, you've stayed strong and you've you've stuck to your values and to what you know you deserve. So I feel like this person has been waiting for you to um, chase them, honestly. And now that they realize that you're not going to chase them, now it's when they're. Um, coming towards you and taking action towards you. Um, yeah, that's basically what I see here. Let me clarify. Chariot, please. Emperor. <laughs> Nine of Cups. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're a little upset here, the Emperor. They're a little bit upset that you haven't um, showed uh, any care about them. It's like they wanted you to show them that you were, they wanted to see that you were sad and depressed, you know, and they wanted to see that you are, that you were weak. But you ended up being a lot stronger than they thought you were, you know, and now they realize that you're not going to um, be chasing them or, um, you know, um, going after them. So now it's like when they're changing their plans, they're changing their strategy, 
and they're coming towards you soon. All right, Cancer, that's what I see. Give me a thumbs up if that resonated. And let's move on to Leo. Leo, what are your person's current feelings for you, Leo? Okay, we have the devil in reverse. The Hierophant upright, the Death card in reverse, <clears throat> and the Four of Swords upright. <clears throat> Leo, I feel like this person has tr has been trying to release you, um, <clears throat> but they haven't been very successful at it because they keep thinking about you here with the Four of Swords. Um, this this person wants commitment here with the hero font, um, but they feel like you don't want the same thing, um, and that's why they've been trying to release you. But they their feelings are still attached to you. Um, they still feel an attachment to an emotional attachment to you. Um, there might be an obsession here with the devil card, um, and they're not ready for things to be over, even though they're trying to move on. Okay, that was a quick message there, Leo, so I hope that resonated. If it did, please give me a thumbs up, and let's move on to Virgo. All right, Virgo, what are your person's current feelings for you, Virgo? And we have King of Pentacles, Knight of Swords in Reverse, Page of Pentacles Upright, and the Moon in Reverse. Okay, let me take a look here. I feel like this person is waiting for you, Virgo. I feel like this person is this card. Um, you might be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra for some of you. Um, they're a little bit intimidated by you, Virgo. Um, they want to reach out to you, but at the same time, they feel like um, it, it would be pointless. They're waiting for you, you to give them some sort of offer here of commitment. Um, but I feel like this person is like ashamed or embarrassed, I, I feel, with this moon card. And it's almost like they're kind of hiding away at the moment. Um, or at least they're not being very truthful or honest with you because it's almost like they're... They're ashamed. I keep getting they're ashamed or embarrassed. Let's clarify. Clarify King of Pentacles. We have the Four of Cups. Wheel of Fortune. Six of Wands. Two of Pentacles. Yeah, they're indecisive here emotionally. Um... Yeah, I feel like this person is not telling you how they feel. They're making it seem like they don't care about you. They're acting very cold and very detached um, and just kind of mean, maybe even disrespectful. But um, in reality, they want to be with you. It's just like they're really arrogant, you know, and they don't want to uh, show weakness. They feel they feel like showing their feelings or telling you their feelings would be a sign of weakness, you know. All right, Virgo, so that's what I see. Give me a thumbs up if it resonated, and let's move on to Libra. 
Libra, what are your person's current feelings for you, Libra? And we have the Six of Swords, Page of Wands in Reverse, Five of Swords in Reverse, the Devil in Reverse. They're trying to release you. They want to walk away from you. They don't want to talk to you anymore here. Page of Wands in Reverse. Or they're avoiding talking to you. Um... They feel like this is toxic and they want to release the, the toxicity or the potential for something toxic. They feel like um, there is a lack of balance or a lack of stability. Um, they feel like you'll return back to them, but if you do return back to them, they, um, as of right now, they, they feel like they would rather um, walk away from this than to give it a second chance all right libra that's what i see that was a um, uh, short message there for you give me a thumbs up if that resonated and let's move on to scorpio all right scorpio what are your person's current feelings for you Alright Scorpio, first card we have for you, Sun in Reverse, Two of Cups Upright, Six of Cups Upright, Four of Cups Upright. Alright Scorpio, you might be dealing with another water sign like yourself, Scorpio, Pisces or Cancer, there's a lot of water energy here. Um, so in terms of this person, this person loves you. They feel a deep emotional connection to you. They might see you as their soulmate. We have the Six of Cups. There might be a long history between you two for some of you. Um, they feel like you two have shared a lot together. or they, they feel like you two have, you know, gone through a lot together. Um, we do have the Four of Cups here, which is an energy of rejection. So they feel like... Um, it's one-sided or it's unrequited their feelings for you um, they feel like this might be a missed opportunity with the sun in the sun card in reverse because they feel like you're not respond let me clarify there clarify the sun seven of swords they might feel like some someone is lying that you're lying seven of pentacles two of pentacles Three of Swords. There might be a third party situation here and they might feel, this person feels like you're going to choose someone else over them. Yeah, they feel like you're involved with someone else and you're going to be going with that other person instead of being with them. And they feel like their feelings are one-sided and um, unrequited. All right, Scorpio, that's what I see there for you. Give me a thumbs up if that resonated, and let's move on to Sagittarius. Sagittarius, what are your person's current feelings for you, Sagittarius? And we have Queen of Pentacles in reverse, Page of Pentacles upright, Star card in reverse, Three of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, the energy I immediately got was, I feel like this person feels like they've lost you. 
we have the star card in reverse. So I feel like this person feels like they're sad, they're depressed, they've lost hope or faith. Um, I almost feel like this is them offering you something with the page of pentacles, but this is you turning your back to the person. Hmm. You know, it's a queen, you know, it, queens, they want, they want something more than, than what this page is offering. What this page is offering, what this page is offering is too little. Um, it's, it doesn't match, you know, their, what the queen deserves. Um, so Sagittarius, you might be feeling like you deserve a lot more than what they're offering you. Um, there might be a third party situation here involved, three of pentacles. It's like, they're not investing themselves completely into this. Um, um, and the star card reverse, it's like feeling like there's no hope for this relationship. All right, that's what I see there. Let me give me a thumbs up if that resonated and let's move on to Capricorn. Capricorn, what are your person's current feelings for you, Capricorn? And we have Knight of Swords in reverse, Knight of Wands upright, Three of Pentacles upright, and the Justice card upright. This person might be walking away from you, Capricorn. I feel like... Um, I feel like this person realizes that there's something unfair going on with the Justice card or something out of balance here. Um, you two might not be on the same page with the Three of Pentacles. You two might be, um, you know, wanting different things or you have, you have different opinions or you have different values. Um, this person is coming up as a knight, so I feel like this person wants more of a casual relationship. Um, and they feel like you want something much more than casual. You want something more committed. But they feel like they can't offer that for some reason. And because of that, I feel like this person is kind of ignoring you. And they're kind of like, you know, walking past you. Alright, that's what I see, Capricorn. It's a short message. Give me a thumbs up if that resonated. And let's move on to Aquarius. Aquarius, what are your person's current feelings for you, Aquarius? Alright, we have Five of Pentacles Reverse, the World Card Upright, the Knight of Pentacles in Reverse, and the Star Card Upright. So Aquarius, this person wants you to return back to them. They, they realize that things have ended between you two, um, that the, the cycle has been closed. The chapter has been closed. Um, yeah, but they want to reopen what was closed, you know? And the star is here, so they're hoping, they have hope that you'll return back to them. They realize that there's a lack of stability, there's a lot of issues here between you two. But they feel like things can be solved, things can be fixed. Um, they have faith that things can be fixed, even though there's a lot of um, issues and there's a lack of stability here. Let's clarify this energy, please. Clarify Five of Pentacles. The Hangman. 
and the lovers yeah they still care about you Aquarius they still feel a deep connection to you a deep attraction to you um, they're they're hoping that you'll see things from a different perspective and that you'll forgive them and you'll want to return back to them yeah they might have been the ones who shut you out with the seven of wands for some of you um and if that's the case then they're definitely um uh repenting uh regretful all right that's what i see there aquarius give me a thumbs up if that resonated and let's move on to pisces all right pisces what are your person's current feelings for you pisces And we have Ten of Wands, Six of Wands Reverse, Seven of Swords, and the King of Pentacles Upright. So this person feels like it's over between you two. This person feels like you've figured out their secrets or you've, you've figured them out already. Um, this person might have been hiding something from you or just being dishonest and they feel like you already have seen um, their true colors and they feel like you're not going to budge they feel like you're going to um, you know stay stay away from them or <clears throat> Yeah, they feel like you're going to, uh, like you're not going to give this a second chance, you know. Let me clarify here a little bit. Ten of Pentacles. The lovers. Ooh. For some of you, this person had a lover, had a cheater, was a cheater here. And the magician. Yeah, the, you're standing in your power. This is how you're, they're seeing you. You're standing in your power. You're standing firm in what you believe and what you know you deserve. And you're not going to um, accept breadcrumbs from anyone. So this person has been discovered or exposed in some way. And yeah, you're, you're over it. And they realize that you're over it. Um, and yeah, they're definitely feeling kind of bad about themselves here. All right, Pisces, that's what I see. So let me know if that resonated. If it did, please give me a thumbs up. I appreciate that. And that's all the signs. Thank you, everyone, for watching the video. I appreciate every single one of you. And I'm sending you all love. And I wish you all the best. All right, bye, guys. Take care.